How are you getting on with the other cast members in Hairspray? Oh, <laughs> well, that actually, um, it's a bit awkward, really, because <laughs> everyone fancies me. So, please, what do you think of Alfie Jukes? Um... He's an idiot, he's rude, he's disgusting. He's a twat. He's horrible, he's just annoying. Wait, who's Alfie? How does he actually get a link? I can't stand him. And he's shit. Oh my god, he thinks he's so good. He's just, ugh, I just want to punch him in the face. Why are you asking these questions? I have a girlfriend. He's probably the ugliest boy I've ever met. Ugh, I just can't explain how much I Oh, she's gone. Oh. Everyone keeps laughing at all my jokes, but it's just a bit okay. awkward. Why couldn't the skeleton be a council kid? Because he had nobody to dance with. Can we have a quick interview with the two leads of the show? Of course you can. Yeah, right. Come <laughs> <laughs> Yes, so, um, why, why couldn't the skeleton be a council kid? Why? He had nobody to dance with. Oh, really so annoying. Ha! Hi guys! So, what are you guys talking about? Just going off dancing. Oh, that's cool. So, do you like them? I mean, I don't. You literally just made them up on the spot. It's hard yeah. to learn them when she's a little bit. She's so annoying. She's so hilarious. Like, she forgets them and then yeah. she screams at us if we get it wrong. Yeah. 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 She has killed four people in the last 30 minutes. Somebody help. Jodie is killing everyone. Jodie is killing everyone one by one. You better save us quick. Um, because... Oh, hello, Mr. Yo, yo. Hello. Do you want to say anything? I have to interview them. Yeah. Let me interview Zach. No, no. Tell us about what it's like it, to it's do the fun. lights. It's, it's fun. Amazing. I'm so Thank you. There you go. Is there anything Thank else you'd you, like Zav. to say about the experience? Oh, wow. That's definitely going in. Is it hot? Oh, my God. Is that Britney Spears? How do you feel about Hairspray ending? Yeah. I really want Hairspray and I really want it. I really want it to win. But I can't and I really, really, really want it to win. But I can't and I really, really want it to win. Watch, get your shit together! Penny and Seaweed. So how are you guys like getting on on We're like best friends. We're friendship gold. Ah. What is your guys' favourite scene in Hairspray to do together? Well, my favourite's Without Love. My favourite's all of them, because we're always together. Uh. <laughs> uh. Uh. The dance move is that, not that. But you're doing that. It's that. No, I'm not. I've just learned them. It's not that hard. Guys. Oh, um, hey! We're practicing. You know, she's meant to be another character. Yeah, yeah. I'm just going. Oh. Yeah. Alright, well, I'll go then. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, just sing! Just learn to sing! Done. Oh my god, it doesn't, it doesn't snow. snow. Oh my god, guys, it's snowing and it's so exciting. Oh my god, 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 it's so exciting. You guys play Brenda and Luann, council kids. That's so nice. obviously you have a lot of scenes together, you spend a lot of time together, but it must be great because you guys like, are best friends, aren't yeah. you? Yeah, no, it's so good because we're literally so close, so it just makes it so easy. Yeah, you do seem really close like on set and stuff. Yeah, we are, aren't we, Lils? <laughs> yeah, um... <laughs> What's so good about working together when you're best friends? Um, it's so good. She's just got my back. I've got her. She's always there for me. We're just best friends. So in sync. We finish each other's... Ah, I think I'm going to leave. <laughs> Typical Lily. She's always like this. Ready? Oh, Tracy. I really thought you guys were like best friends. It's, I don't know what she's doing, I just can't, can't deal with her anymore. You ready, Lils? You coming? 
Yeah, one second. Lily! Is that Tracy Turnblad? Fire! It's our Tracy Turnblad! Once again, your monumental hair note has seriously stuck in everyone's food. Okay, Leah, what's been your favourite um, moment? My favourite bit is probably Ollie when he's the PE teacher. Oh my god. And he's like, like, he's like, I've come That is when amazing. When it's in slow motion, yeah. where he's like stuck in slow motion. Yeah, it's really good. Mm -hmm. oh, no. My favourite part of the show, I know where I've been, or when Xander goes Tracy Turn. <laughs> probably on the last show when Jodie spoke into her still life mic. Like, so, hey, don't do that. Saskia, have you got it? Oh god, in the corner. Oh god, no, I'm embarrassed. <laughs> <laughs> My favourite moment of the whole play would definitely be when Grace, aka Prudy Pingleton, is um, tying her daughter up because going to jail without your permission is the worst thing your child can do. Also because there were children. When we did the Macarena in the hall with most of the cast, because everyone was really like upset after the uh, show in the daytime because the crowd was great, but it brought everyone's moods back. Miss Hopeful on got in. Yeah. <laughs> I think the show worked really well because it was really colourful and it was really lively and everyone just gave their best and everyone just chimed in with everything. And there wasn't people who were more left out. Everyone had, you know, the big finale at the end and everyone got pretty even parts. I just wanted to say thank you to everyone that was in Hairspray. I love you all very much and it's been a blast. I'm sad to see your year 11s go because I'm going to miss them. We all need to meet up like in 20 years, Hairspray reunion, to come back and sing I know where I've been. Well definitely when Alfie failed to say Rock Hudson. Rock Hudson, do it now. Rock Hudson. <laughs> All over me. I don't know how those girls stand. <laughs> um, I like the bit when Velma okay, comes in um, and she's got a headscarf on and her glasses and she just comes in being angry. <laughs> My favourite bit was doing You Can't Stop the Beat for the first night because that's something that's nice to do with um, the whole cast. But I preferred it on the first night because by the second night it was kind of sad because the last song we're gonna do. My favorite bit was um, you can't stop the beat because you can't stop the beat and like dancing and stuff. Yeah. On the final night when Zach forgot his line and you played it off like he was completely just mesmerized. He was just like, oh, yeah. <laughs> it was really because I generally thought that was part yeah, no, I, of it as well. We kind of all looked at each other like. Yeah, it's something like new. Yeah. It was great. Thank you so much, Miss Holt, for everything. You've been amazing. I love you so much. And also, I love you so much, Miss Holt. Thank you for passing on the Tracy, whatever it's called that they use in sports. I don't talk sports. In Reno. Thank you. Love you so much. Thank you. I love you so much for putting up with me. But just the fact that you've made this massive diverse group of people into something so iconic and legendary is literally amazing. So I just want to say, that's not me speaking, but you know, well done. Oh, we love you lots. Thank you, I love you so much. <laughs> Killing us when we mess up our harmonies constantly. <laughs> Thanks for being an awesome teacher. Thank you for being nice to all of us doing the rehearsal projects when we messed up and stuff. Cool. Thank you for, you're the best teacher ever. I don't know what to say. We love you, Miss Holt. Thank, thank you so much. much. Hi, I just wanted to take this time to thank everyone who came to watch Hairspray and I definitely want to dedicate a huge thank you to Miss Holt for physically and emotionally draining herself just so she can put up with us without going mentally insane. So yeah, thanks Miss Holt.
Hey, um, thank you very much for including me in the show. Thank you very much, Miss Hawk, for supporting me and Cal's lovely and, relationship in her school. And thank you for letting me do the lights. Love you, Miss Hawk. You helped me reach my notes in sheet. Thanks for not letting me in after I'd auditioned for Link. <laughs> um, thank you for everything you've done. You really helped me. We love you very much. So, Miss Hawk, thank you so much for putting this show together. If it wasn't for you, I don't know what we'd do. We wouldn't have that organisation, we wouldn't be dealing with anything. It'd be a whole lot of stress, a whole lot of pain. It would have just been a disaster. Since you came to Hope Park and I was a man in Les Mis, um, you've just always been there and you've always known what to say and, and you've always just helped us all through everything. And not only with drama and singing and whatever, but like, we could come to you with anything and we just know you'd be there to to help us because you're just one of those one of those kind of people. I just wanted to say thank you for everything and I love you so much and um, you've just given me loads of confidence and you're so inspiring. You're just really special to all of us and you've um, given me the confidence to do what I want to do when I leave school and I don't want to leave because you've made my whole school experience so thank you. We love you, we love you, we love you. Uh, thanks Miss Holt, um, it's always a great experience doing this and you make it so much fun and you always seem like you have everything under, under control and that's really great. I love how you're strict, but only when you need to be, and you're also very fun. It's just been so afrotastic to chill with you guys. Alfred. <laughs> and I'm Mr. Lyle. <laughs> <laughs>